My dad, he won't sit still. He kind of always has to be doing something. He's kind of fidgety like that, but I think that's a good quality. Daddy, come here. He never stops. Daddy, we sh really shouldn't have any chairs in the house because he never sits down, so <laughs> that's his nature. He's a busybody. Javier Castellano does not like to wait. But the 45-year-old Hall of Fame jockey does know how to be patient, a fact that we reminded him of two weeks ago, just moments before his 16th Kentucky Derby. Javier Castellano still looking for his first. 0 for 15. I was Javier Castellano, 0 50. When we saw that, I say myself, this is my year. 18 horses set to go the mile and a quarter in the 149th running of the Kentucky Derby. I was in the stands and I was like, hi, Dad. And then he waved at me and I was like, good luck. And then he went off because he had to go. They're off in the Kentucky Derby. He was behind because the horse is very slow in the beginning and he doesn't like break out good. And then comes Mage. He is near the back of the pack early on. And then he'll like come up his way and just take off. And they're into the stretch. Here's Mage coming strongly down the outside. Mage is gonna attack the horse. He's gonna come from behind. Mage is taking the lead here. He took off and there you go. I'm gonna win the derby. And it is going to be Mage under Javier Castellano. And Javier Castellano, the Hall of Famer, in his 16th try, has finally won the Kentucky Derby. When I saw him win, I was very happy. I was crying because it was super exciting. It's like very cool that your dad's like one of the best. Run, Brady, run. Go, 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 go. Javier Castellano will tell you he would have loved to win the Derby on his first try, or his second, or even his 15th. But savoring the win that came at last with the people who mean the most has made it worth the wait. Don't overcook. It's like mesh. It goes slow, nice and easy, from the beginning to the end. So far, so good, guys. Just gonna have a good dinner. I like to teach my kids when you work hard and dedicate yourself to get what you want and you get it. Cheers, guys. That's the best feeling in the world.